Hey guys, here's a quick review of Ozito Power Exchange Hot Glue. Um, uh, what is it called? The hot glue gun, 11 millimeter, 18 volt um, hot glue gun. So, uh, is is this worth the money? And um, the total cost of this tool as the 10th of um, 2009 was approximately 39 Australian dollars. It is really, really surprisingly well made. And um, th there's this, uh, there are two tips, precision tip, which gives you thinner, uh, sort of smaller glue beads. And uh, I've used it in many different occasions, especially with this um, one and a half uh, amp battery. It's extremely lightweight. If So if you're going to work uh, in an environment like, for example, on um, towards the roof or somewhere and or, or like a quick job, like if you need to walk around your property and um, if you need to apply glue somewhere really quickly, you know, it's like you know teeny tiny jobs it's golden you know golden for that so how long it takes for it to warm up it is surprisingly quick you just have to press the button and in now at the moment it's got red led as you say that it's red led and once it heats up the tip it becomes um, green led the glue sticks um, which um, is shipped with the item itself. It's really, really good quality. Like um, I applied um, onto, and you can see also the the preheating time is 120 seconds. I can confirm that it is really quick, really fast, and this is this is also correct. And the temperature <laughs> is surprisingly hot, as well as the glue sticks uh, quality is surprisingly. Good. I was uh, in between buying Ryobi and uh, the Ozito one, and I said, "Heck, you know, I'll give it a go." And um, I got Ozito, Ryobi, and Milwaukee tools, and I can strongly uh, say that this one has no like differences, also advantages over the Ryobi one, um, because uh, somehow this one seems to have hotter temperatures than the Ryobi one. Not to mention uh, the design is more, uh, you know, ergonomic. Just like, you know, if you if you work prolonged hours, it's not going to hurt your, uh, you know, hands or it's not going to annoy. Like the, some of the, the Ryobis, they, they, they are really, um, you know, in comparison, they are really, really <clears throat> not that well made for, especially for the the single. Uh, how can I say the handles or some stuff like that? They some of them are really solid. And yeah, now it's green LED. Uh, I was just, you know, it's like it's already starting to drip. And if you apply. On a surface, you know, like a like the the other thing is that you can actually turn off save battery power. It will be still hot. It's like um, uh, it's pretty hot there. I mean, I can I cannot I can grip this side. It's really really really, you know, like I can feel the warmth coming up towards to the to the end. And there's this silicone attachment here. Um, so you don't burn your uh, fingers or just like, you know, if, if it, you know, if you drop it accidentally somewhere. Um, but the other thing is that also the other advantage is the shimu of the glue doesn't come up all the way. But yeah, overall, if anybody's like, I don't know how, how to go full test and full review of a glue applicator glue slash glue gun and the, the but this thing is surprisingly well made and I, I'm really happy with it. The, the trigger seems to be, you know, like it doesn't flex whatsoever at all. 
you know, some of the Ryobi ones, they, they have like, you know, the, the trigger has got a lot of movement. And it's the, the advantage is it's really, really lightweight. That's something with, if you use it with one and a half amp hour battery. And it's really, really good. Uh, the only thing which bo uh, really bothers me is that the color now they from this uh, sort of um, dull cherry red color to bright fire red color they changed though so it's just like a little bit annoying to see the different colors but you know uh, overall that's the only complaint that I can make uh, I, I went through you know not much amount of glue sticks but <laughs> I've been applying here and there and here and there and the batteries, you know, and uh, batteries went only one one bar. So that's it. Uh, if you're if you're thinking, you know, I said I give it a go. This thing is really really good for the buck. Just you know, the price is it's really you know, at the end of the day, you uh, you know, uh, it's really economics wise really good price and. Um, I'm really happy how it looks, how it uh, operates. All right, hope it helps.